everyone, it's Mia from Unicorn Playroom. Today we are looking at the complete history of Ed's World. We don't get to see much of the main character's childhood, but if you want to see what they look like as little kids, well, check out the episode Power Ed. In a flashback, it shows Ed, Tom, Matt, and Tord in preschool or kindergarten, and they look really adorable. I mean, just look at how cute Ed looks when he's drawing. And here's a picture of Beverly when she was in kindergarten. And yes, yeah, she still sucked on her pacifier in kindergarten. <laughs> The very first episode of Ed's World was Ed Again, and it was released in 2004. That's when Ed and Matt made their first appearances. And then the Christmas special came out that same year. That's when Tom and Tord made their first appearances. And in the episode Zomba Nation, Beverly made her first appearance in the show wearing a hot pink sweater with black stripes. However, the zombie episodes are non can it wasn't until the episode Casino Night where Beverly made her first canon appearance dancing with Ed. Today, Ed's World is the best animated series in the entire world in my opinion. There's a new season 3 that came out in 2021 called Ed's World Beyond. And I think it's really amazing. The characters still look the same, the animation style is great, the story plots are awesome, and there's a ton of easter eggs. And the possible return of Tord and Beverly. But what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. We don't know what Ed, Tom, Matt, and Tord are like in the future, but there is one future-themed episode. What the future. In What the Future, Ed's future self tries to kill his present-day self with Cola before being stopped by Tom's future self and Matt's future self. And you can imagine how shocked they were. How can this plan get any worse? Stop right there! Oh god, I'm old! Hey, uh, why the eye thing? Remember that laser you took to the face? Uh, yeah? Cancer. Huh. Anyway. Ed, we're here to stop you before you destroy the future for your selfish needs. No! I won't go back! I won't go back to that bleak, soda-free future! And then... All heck broke loose. No, Susan! is known as the Red Leader, and the only evidence of Beverly's future self is in this picture. We can see that she has a ring on her finger, implying that her and Ed are married in the future, which is really sweet considering that her and Ed are in a relationship. We can also see that she's got a crown on her head with the earth on it, implying that she's the queen of the world. And that's the complete history of Ed's world. I hope you liked it, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!